What's good? What's up, Messy Mob? It's your girl, Messy Maya, and I am back again with another video. So today, we're going to be getting into how the Baddies Caribbean, season five, child, apparently, allegedly, the auditions over there then got canceled, okay? They don't want to do it no more, and we're going to get into it all. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and turn on that post notification bell. So you know every single time I post a new video, baby, it's Messy Maya. It's the Messy Mob. We are lit over here. Trust and believe that, and yeah. Let's go ahead and get into it. So as y'all know, for the past two seasons of Baddies, Baddies West, and Baddies East, Zeus held auditions for basically the girls that, you know, aren't too much known. You know what I'm saying? The girls that just want to have an opportunity to be on their show. So they had these girls click on a link, sign a form, basically confirming that they're going to show up to the auditions. Okay, these girls travel from all around the country to come to this audition, to come to this venue, most likely got to stand outside for hours, okay? In the hot, cold, rain, girl, whatever it is, nine times out of ten, they hide, they all together, girl, it's a lot of people, child, they getting irritated, they start bumping outside, child, they start scrapping outside, the girls is mad, you know what I'm saying, they they get on stage, they show their ass, they get, they get told to do this, to do that, they get spoke to any kind of way, next, for no reason, child, all for nothing, all for nothing, all for them, months down the line for Zeus to post on their pages pretty much that they basically never had a chance to begin with because they post this pre-picked ass cast <laughs> you know what I'm saying like that's really like that's really the gist of the whole audition thing when it comes to baddies like you you're going to audition but you're not really auditioning you're really just being used for content and views that's really what it is to keep a long story short, the auditions are not really the auditions. And a lot of us determined this a long time ago, baby. But word on the street, allegedly, is that Zeus is calling it quits when it comes to the auditions for the new season of Baddies called Baddies Caribbean. All right, Messy Mob. So let's go ahead and get into this mess and this tea. So this says, allegedly, there won't be no auditions holding place for Baddies Caribbean. Instead, auditions from previous seasons will be looked at again along with an already confirmed cast okay child so this really reminds me of baddie south casting let me tell you why so it reminds me of baddie south casting because there were no auditions for baddies south there were none you know what i'm saying like they really handpicked these girls and said these are going to be the girls that are going to come on they didn't try to trick the audience into you know watching a two-part long two-part drawn out audition series just for them not to end up picking anybody because that's really what they do they literally use their auditions for content and i wish if they were just gonna do that that they would just be straight up and say uh, for a content purpose only uh, uh, for content purposes only but they don't even do that chap they don't even give us that courtesy so i feel like it's like baddie south casting because again baddie south really there there were no audition there was no audition process there were no auditions for Baddie South. Like, they just picked their cast and they went about their day. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like if they really want to make a comeback with their franchise, they need to take a page out of Baddie South book. Because Baddie South was the best, to, in my opinion. Y'all can say what y'all want. But in my opinion, I feel like Baddie South was honestly the best out of the entire um, Baddie season. I feel like Baddie South, they got it right. I really do. I feel like they got it right. There were no fake. They there were. They, it didn't. They didn't start off the season with a fake audition process. They picked their girls. You know what I'm saying? Although most of the girls were known, they picked two unknown girls. Child, even though that Scotty swore up and down she run the south. Child, Natalie swore up and down that Natalie she she this is my Miss Scotty and she runs the south. She's from the south, baby girl. Cause the girls in North Carolina said they ain't never heard of that girl ever. Okay. But that is besides the point. So my thing is, is that they had two unknown girls, which was Ann Moore and Scotty with the ran through body. Okay. And then they had like their BGC girls. They had, you know, 
who else? They had Roly and Slim from One More Chance. And yeah, I feel like they're, I feel like the way that they mixed up their cast on Batty South was perfect. We seen every single beef unfold on camera. There was no pre-planned beef. There was no going back and forth on the internet before they got into the house. Leaving half of the audience confused. You know what I'm saying? There was no them going live, talking about each other, talking about each other in the comments, going back and forth in the comments before. No, we seen every single beef on Batty South unfold on camera. So again, I don't know if this is true or not, but if it is true, I feel like they might be going in the route of Batty South, okay? You know what I'm saying? Because I'm trying to tell you, Girl, if they have another season flop of Baddies or another flop show in general on Zeus, I, I just don't know. Like, I don't, like, I feel like that's really not an option at this point with Zeus. It's just like, y'all really just got to get y'all stuff together. So it's like, maybe they're going back to the drawing board and looking at a season that did good. Like, you know what I'm saying? And not did good as in numbers because we all know that Baddies West pulled more numbers than Baddies South. But I'm talking about doing good as in production doing good as in security not being biased doing good as in not having two separate ha houses having all the girls stay under one roof doing good as in again authentic beef not f not not beef that is pre-planned on camera by natalie okay you know what i'm saying like like i feel like baddie south was the most authentic but let's move on Okay, so I'm not going to lie, like, I really could care less, like, <laughs> about how they're going to, and it honestly makes sense because it's just, like, it's in the Caribbean. Usually, they hold the auditions and the lo the, lo the coast that the show is going to be at, like, you know, when it was Baddies West, they held it in the West Coast, when it was Baddies East, they held it in the East Coast. So, it's like, it's Baddies Caribbean, so it's like, are you going to... Unless you're going to have auditions in the Caribbean, it's just like, eh. And it's like, I really don't know. I don't know. Like, I really don't mind it. Like, because we all know at the end of the day that their auditions, the audition process is a jam. Like, it's not real. It's made up. It's a fairy tale. Like, you're literally going there to be used for content. Like, it's not real at all. Like, hella people had already came out and said that, like, when you actually get there, you realize that it's all a facade. It's all for TV. It's all for content at the end of the day. It's not actually so you could go and audition. You know what I'm saying? To be, to have a chance to have a spot on that show. No, it's not. Like, if it was an actual real audition process, then it's like, okay, cool. Like, you know. But no, they been stopped. They, they never, they never did it. They never did it. Come on now. Their audition picks from Baddies East were clear, were clear setups. They were clear setups, baby. You know what I'm saying? Clear setups. Mariah Lynn, come on now. They told Mariah Lynn to come to the auditions. Tessiki. They told Tessiki to come to the auditions. Girl. Anna Mac. Anna Mac has been in the Zeus world for a uh, Zeus world for a while. Going to Zeus events, going to their premieres. You know what I'm saying? They went she went to the uh, Zeus headquarters launch party. Baby, she's been in there already. Smiley. Only reason why Smiley got picked is because she did what she did to Mariah Lynn's sister and that beef carried out outside of the show. That's the only reason why she got picked. But either way, whether they truly like it. Okay, l let's just say Mariah Lynn, Tessiki, Anamak, and Smiley were unknown. It's, it's just like the fact that you had an ad audition with thousands of people come and y'all only picked four audition picks. Out of a fifteen, out of a fifteen girl cast, girl. So not even half of the cast were audition picks. That's still a jam. It, it's still a jam. I don't care. Like, let it be known from the beginning that a little bit of girls are gonna get picked from the auditions, or only the well known girls that come to the auditions are only gonna get picked. Or let it be like, but no, but they try to really make it seem like, oh yeah, well if you're this or that, you have a chance to be on the show absolutely not girl we already know so honestly i really don't i never cared for the auditions yes they are interesting but i never really cared for them because it's at the end of the day y'all wasting people time y'all having people literally 
take flights and drive all the way across the country to audition for your show, knowing good and well that they don't have a chance to be on there. Okay, the girls, I'm talking about the girls is uh, five seconds into into their little uh, intro speech to tell the girls why they should be on the show. And it's the next. Can you could you imagine literally driving across the country to audition for something? And within the first five seconds, they tell you next. Not only that, but you, girl, nine times out of ten, girl, you was waiting in the hot sun cooped up. You know what I'm saying? Like, no. So I never thought that. Although, yeah, I feel like a hypocrite. Although I feel like they're a little interesting, I never thought that it was real. I always thought it was a fantasy. You know what I'm saying? And I always thought that it was a little unfair because why waste people time like that? Okay, so let's go ahead and address something else that was in that little, you know, on that little tea page, baby. So it also said, instead of doing the auditions, they're going to take previous audition, you know, previous audition, previous girls that audition, child, can't even get it out. They're going to take previous girls that auditions, review their tapes, review their auditions, and, you know, put them uh, as, as, you know, as a little choice to be a part of the show. I feel like that's their best bet. If, if they're really being for real, I feel like that's honestly their best bet. Or, you know, just a little bright idea here. Since you guys are going to the Caribbean, you guys really could just have a Caribbean cast. Like, <laughs> I'm just saying. Y'all really could. But, you know, whatever, child. Every single time y'all go anywhere, y'all don't ever. Child, y'all did baddies. What? Y'all did baddies east, girl. Y'all did baddies east. And y'all had, what, what, what? The auditions in the DMV. Child ain't picked not now one. Like, it just made no sense. It made absolutely no sense. All right, so y'all let me know how y'all feel about it allegedly being no audition process for ba- for season five baddies Caribbean baby. Y'all let me know how y'all feel. It's Messy Maya. I'm out this hoe. Bye. Your